How to mark messages as unread on AOL Mail. Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. I am Bimu from the Solution Guide. In today's guide video, I will show you the way on how you can actually mark messages as unread on AOL Mail. But before we get started with the video, if you are new to our channel, do make sure to leave a like and hit the subscribe button. And without any further ado or delay, let us get started with today's video. Now first of all, simply make sure you have either downloaded or updated the AOL Mail app to the latest version and you can do this by heading over to your app store in the search box typing in AOL Mail and go ahead and simply either download or update the app. Once you've updated the AOL Mail app, I want you to go over and simply open it up. The next thing you want to make sure is that you are logged into your account. After you are logged in, then you can see this is how the interface is actually going to look like. Now what you have to do is first of all, you have to tap on the inbox button which is at the bottom left corner of the screen and once you go to the inbox page you will see all these options all you have to do is you have to select the mail which you want to mark as unread for example you can see these are some of the emails that i've already read if i want to mark them as unread just long press on it and select it and tap on the mark as unread button over here as you do that you can see this little dot over here which indicates that this message is not read you can repeat the process for any of the other mails that you want to receive and select mark as unread and just like that you can repeat the process for all the other apps if you go ahead and open it up it will be marked as read and if you also go ahead and simply just choose to long press on it and select mark as read that will be read in that way as well but this is how you can mark messages as unread on AOL mail we hope the video was really helpful and if it did help you make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you have any more questions queries or doubts simply also make sure to leave them down below thank you very much for watching till the end of this tutorial and see you soon in our next video